The planets and moons in our solar system are rather hostile. For instance, in Venus it rains sulfuric acid, while in Enceladus, one of Saturn's moons, there's a 12-mile thick ice layer covering a global ocean. So, if we want to colonize outer space, Mars looks like our best option. There's a range of building options from ready-made modules to taking advantage of underground cavities. However, the best option is a build-on-site approach. Dubai has become the testbed for the first Martian city. It will be based on several domes, a shape which provides the best protection and optimum space. All structures will be created through 3D printing processes that make use of the desert sand just like in Mars. The first stage will see a cover put into place to protect the machines at the building site. Once there's protection against the wind and extreme temperatures, the machines start working. Excavators and 3D printers using the sands from Mars, which will be the main building material. This is an additive process that places successive layers until the structure is completed. Thus, there will be three levels of protection the external cover, the structures of the buildings, and the underground insulation. In the future, the Mars Science City will comprise several domes with their own functions. The common areas will be research labs, farming area, living units for settlers. The modular design has the potential to house new interconnected domes as the population grows. In this way, the population could increase exponentially, although the effects of a long stay in another planet remain unknown. Once this conquest has been achieved, there will be another challenge left, learning to live together in a new world.